You got to. Uh, you can't worry about the other team. You got to stick to what you know and stick to what you do. And what, what is that tonight against the Celtics? Uh, you know this opponent is better than anybody. Yeah. I mean, you know, they're going to – whoever plays going to bring that A game. Uh, you know, like us, you know, when guys don't play, you know, other guys just get that confidence. Uh, so, you know, for us, we just got to hone in, lock in, and – you know, KYP, know your personnel, uh, and know their tendencies. And the, the offensive numbers being what they are this season, none of you guys have ever seemed to be particularly concerned about the offense. What, what is it about the way you guys are approaching offense that gives you so much confidence? I mean, one thing is you got to play both sides regardless. So, uh, you know, for us, it's, like I said, if we get stops in transition, I feel like that just gives us a better chance of offense rather than running in the, in the half court set. Uh, I feel like that's the best thing for us, you know. Ask about Grant every time. But uh, <laughs> does it get more fun, less fun playing against him? Nah, definitely more fun because uh, I think I'm up in the record. <laughs> I think. Are you? I don't know. It's close. It's close. It's yeah. close. Uh, but yeah, I mean, when you. When your two guys come from the same state, uh, you played against each other since high school. You know, it's one of those things where you keep that competitive nature. Uh, and then, you know, at the end of the game, somebody's always going to have that, that one up. Uh, and, you know, that's what, that's what basketball is all about, competing, playing hard, having fun. What have you seen in his growth over the last couple of years? Uh, his body has changed. Uh, when he first got in the league, he was a little tubby. <laughs> and I tell him that uh, regardless, he knows it. But the fact that he's changed his body and uh, really bought in to, you know, lifting weights, getting in shape, and uh, he's been shooting it better. You know, he, he's one of those guys now. He's kind of like one of those detail-oriented guys on their team where he's in the right spot at the right time all the time. Did he always talk this much? Yeah, he was a politician in, uh, in high school. Uh, yeah, because it got so much history to it. You know, I mean, the history doesn't go anywhere, uh, and that's the that's the beautiful thing about these two organizations, man. Uh, every time we go in there, or every time they 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 come on uh come in our court, you know, it's a different it's a different energy because you know you see the Boston green and you got the Miami Heat red and the the whole history with it. It's just uh, it just gives. You know, I'm not just going to say only us, but the fans have something to look for. How different are they with and without Ross? I mean, that's their uh, number one the defense guy. Uh, I mean, that's that's the easiest answer I can give you. I mean, he, he's one of those guys who blocks shots and does his job, and I've never heard him complain about it. So, I mean, you know, I've only heard good things from JT. Are you close to JT? Uh... Yeah, I mean, for a guy that I've known since 12. <laughs> and, yeah, so uh, knowing JT from 12, you know, we've had history. We've played against each other uh, at the highest level and still keeping in contact every once in a while. Uh, you know, I consider him one of my good friends in the NBA. And uh, anytime I do need to reach out, reach out to him, he might answer. I don't know. <laughs> do you think he's getting enough attention for the MVP conversation? Uh, yeah, I mean he's putting, yeah for sure he's putting the, he's putting the league on notice that he wanted it. Uh, he told us last year that he wanted to go for MVP, and I know I feel like he's doing everything in his will that people have to pay attention to that. What you mean? He said he told us. See, see, you you too far into it. See, see, too far into it. Just it's just us. So it's just the the guys who know JT. Okay. There you go. That's it. Thank you. Boom. Nah, you could, you could.